Hello, fellow MGHers. Every year, when we flip the calendar to February, we see it, the 14th, that designated day when we are supposed to tell those around us how important they are. Now, I don't believe we should reserve appreciation for a single day. It's enormously important to share gratitude and expressions of love, both big and small, as often as we can. Here at Mass General, we are fortunate to be able to share our own versions of love letters year round through appreciation and affection that is seen, heard, and felt in our daily routines. It is obvious in the care, comfort, and support we provide to our patients and their families. It was seen in the paper hearts adorning the windows above the main entrance, bringing smiles to patients and staff alike. It is heard in the hearty laughter and through the rich conversations we have with our colleagues. It is evident within the exceptional educational opportunities we provide, the groundbreaking research we conduct, and the diverse communities we serve. And it can be viewed, and oftentimes now heard, in the construction of our new building. Perhaps our greatest labor of love right now. What you may not always be aware of is the amount of actual love letters delivered to MGH. Every day I receive note cards, drawings, emails, beautifully crafted cursive letters from patients and families thanking individual staff members and teams. Some thank us for saving a loved one's life. Other detail the incredible support they received during the death of a loved one. Some include family photographs documenting moments that may not have been possible if not for your complete dedication to their patient. Many others commend our support staff, from clean rooms to welcoming es escorts to a hearty meal in our cafeterias. I'd like to share a sampling of a few of the recent messages I've received. Throughout my stay, I was struck by the sense of teamwork and collaboration that was evident among the staff. It was clear that everyone was working together to ensure that every patient received the best possible care. I felt reassured knowing I was in such capable hands. Here, you are a tremendous team comprised of outstanding professionals, all of whom possess uncommon compassion, generosity, and patience. Please accept our profound gratitude and best wishes for continued success and blessing. I'd also like to share a small portion of a wonderful opinion piece printed in the Gloucester Daily Times last month. I awakened to the diverse and wonderful faces of nurses, doctors, and staff at the Massachusetts General Hospital, where respect for education, for science, for excellence, for diversity, and for relieving human suffering is an example of what, in the view of the Enlightenment, America should be about. And finally, the simple yet so very powerful three lines in this note card. You always move a mountain for me. It's important to say thank you. Thank you for helping me. So on this day, like every day, I'd like to join the many voices singing your praises. Thank you, each member of our MGH family, for your dedication, compassion, curiosity, insight, and commitment. And of course, for the love you show for your patients, for one another and for Mass General. Thank you.